Hello, I'm Sarah Weiss with Go Go Yoga for Kids and welcome to Mindfulness Month. I love this focus on using mindfulness with kids in a variety of ways. I am an author of Go Go Yoga for Kids, a complete guide to using yoga with kids, and also the creator of the Kids Yoga Challenge postcards. I am also a school teacher and a kids yoga instructor. So I get a lot of time and experience to introduce mindfulness and movement with kids. One of my passions is using read aloud books to help engage kids in a variety of ways. When kids are moving, it helps enhance their understanding and retention of what they've learned. This is called kinesthetic learning and it's perfect to use with those busy, wiggly kids that need to move their bodies. So the books I'm going to show you can be read aloud and then there are opportunities to move and be mindful and try some yoga poses. The first book is Chicka Chicka Boom Boom. And this book is fun because it is about a coconut tree. So the kids can work on tree pose. They can add coconuts to their tree. I also love the beginning of this book. It has all the letters in brightly, um, brightly, colored, brightly colored. So the kids can work on making the different letters, their body mindfully and in different ways. Another pair of books that I love to use for themes, I use these in my school classroom or um, read alouds in my kids yoga classes are Rumble in the Jungle and Commotion in the Ocean. And these books are wonderful because each page focuses on a different jungle animal. They're rhymy and they're fun and kids enjoy listening to them um, and then trying out the different movement or yoga pose. Uh, you can work on Cobra pose here, Gorilla pose. With Commotion in the Ocean, you've got Shark pose, Dolphin pose, Boat pose. So you read the little rhyme and then do the corresponding pose. A lot of fun. The last book I want to show you is one of my favorites. This is perfect for younger ages, uh, probably six and under. It's called Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? And this book is also fabulous because each page has a different animal that the kids learn about. I've got a whole lesson plan for you that I have laid out that you can kind of see how you can incorporate the different animals in this book with games and mindfulness and movement. And it is at gogoyogakids.com slash bear. So go ahead and find it and uh, get your own lesson plan copy. It can be used at home, preschools, daycares, any child care center. That's wonderful. So here are just a few read aloud books that are my favorite. I would love to hear what your favorite read alouds are. So if you have a favorite one that you use with mindfulness or movement um, while reading aloud to kids, go ahead and leave a comment below. Again, I'm Sarah Weiss with Go Go Yoga for Kids, and thanks for watching.